This is CBS 2 News at 5. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Dana Kozlov. Welcome to our viewers on TV and on our digital streaming network, CBS News Chicago. We begin with a breaking news update. Hundreds of people have been forced from their homes tonight after a major fire at an apartment complex in West Suburban Oak Brook Terrace. As CBS 2's Dorothy Tucker explains, fire officials call the preliminary cause an act of God. The loudest be three. While the campaign trail kicks into high gear, Republican hopefuls fan out to key battleground states. Can they get their message out to voters ahead of the first debate, now less than a month away? Need to know what's happening right now? CBS News Chicago is streaming 24-7 right now. With all the latest information you need right at your fingertips, find us on Pluto TV. Just look for the news and opinion page or by searching CBS News Chicago. You can also power up your Roku and Fire TV devices and search for the CBS News app. CBS News Chicago, streaming 24-7 on Pluto TV and on the CBS News app on Roku and Fire TV. Republicans are hitting the campaign trail this weekend following the announcement of more charges against former President Donald Trump in the classified documents case. But as CBS 2's Christian Benavides tells us, Mr. Trump remains his party's front runner. Back front, especially in Northwest Indiana, we had some three to six foot waves earlier in the day today. I think we'll see a lot of sunshine for the early part of the week and the temperatures are expected to warm up. We're going back into the upper 80s by Wednesday. One chance of rain, at least significant rain in the forecast. That's on Thursday with a chance of storms. All right, Rob, thank you. And thank you for joining us. I'm Dana Kozlov. Yeah, have a great evening. We're back at 10 after 48 hours. And while we're away, make sure you download our free CBS Chicago app for updates throughout the night on our digital streaming network, CBS News Chicago. Have a great night, everyone. Hope to see you at 10.